My name is Figo Bratzlowicz. I'm a beatmaker. I'm living in Berlin since nine years and I'm doing music and I'm happy to live by that. I also produce for other people, um, mainly in the focus that uh, I'm not a producer like I don't do certain any styles, like you cannot ask me for, uh, let's say, uh, uh, whatever, a trap beat, and then I'm gonna do that. No, it's more like people mostly ask for my trademark sound. My studio setup isn't <laughs> the best at the moment, but um, it works. I have uh, a lot of native gear at the moment because it's very fast to work with, and I like the integration with the, the plugins and the hardware. I'm creating like a ground loop, like the ground thing, and from that I'm gonna start to change and gonna be creative. Very simple drums in the beginning, and from that point I'm, I see what I can do. I would say that the drums is my trademark, the way how I flip them, the funkiness, the velocity, the sound itself, the design of the drums. There's many ways to do drums. You can have like a sample from a record. You have already now this, all these libraries, for example. I work with both of them because I create my own sound. Then if I have a kick drum with a, with a high frequency on it, maybe I just want to have the low, like, you know, like a, a deep one. So I filter that, I take another one, a second one, a third one, until I got my dope drum sound. The only thing I don't do is basically using drum loops and just pitch them, whatever. I really cut them if I use some Clyde Stubblefield drums or something. Basically, I do music since 22 years, so um, I got a lot of uh, sample material, and there's always a chance to flip something twice. Velocity, by the way, is this, this little details, right? Like when you have this, now the drums have this, there's like a lot of ghost notes now inside and they're very low, so it's more groovy, right? And step by step you can add so much that also the flow of the MCs or the singers can do, like you can be more like, more groovy, right? More groovy, that's, that's why I like, it's the groove, um, that's how I work mostly. The whole sample pack of native instruments offers a lot of interesting sounds. Um, also the other plugins, like because I have to complete, I'm using a lot of plugins, like the reactor has interesting sounds and also the way how you can shape things around or the guitar rig is one of the best interesting tools even for vocals for, for creating weird stuff. Like you can, it's not only for guitar, right? It's like you can use it very interesting and um, also contact of course, massive, for example, is also very interesting for me because the way how I can shape really my, my tones is very interesting. For the output where people outside, they, they heard a lot of 90s vibes of mine, but in here at home, I also create some electro funk, some blues, some um, disco boogie, uh, all that kind of stuff, which it's time by time, step by step, I'm trying to, to put it to the audience. But my main focus is definitely um, the drums in general for this hip hop thing. Why do I feel this way? So dizzy. Help me to concentrate. All these memories in my head don't make sense at all. So call the doctor. Please call my doctor. The most interesting or most important part actually is my scent, my incident scent. Because um, I really, I think I don't have any, at all one beat which is dry. Like I always have a, a nice reverb, delays and stuff in it. Um, this is also when I create a beat, I don't create just a template or something, I'm redesigning it straight. So I 
I do the mixing process by creating. And that saves me a lot of time so I can make a song in one day or two or three songs in one day uh, from scratch. Because if I'm running into it and I'm doing it, because of my experience of, of nearly 23 years soon, uh, I really kind of know what I do. So it's, there must be a time for me also where I try to find out like how I can trick myself not to always know what I'm doing in a way like that I be more open again for, for new methods, you know? Because somehow it is a method which is working, right? So it's good, but also I'm getting a bit lazy, a little bit, like, you know, when, like there, there has to be new methods as well. So dizzy, why do I 